Hey guys, Ricardo here. Welcome to another blog tech tips. And of course, guys, in today's tutorial, I'll be showing you how to reset your Instagram password. This is great for cases where you've forgotten your Instagram password. Now, this happens a lot from time to time. You may have created your account a long time ago. And of course, you may have forgotten what the exact password was, especially if you have been logged into your device for a very long time and the need was not ever there to log back in all right so if that is the issue do not worry this tutorial will guide you through the process all right so we're going to look at the most common situation so go ahead and unlock and this tutorial is mainly for the iphone but of course other devices should be very similar so of course you're going to go ahead and launch the instagram application and of course right away you might see right here that you're at this particular screen and once you're at this particular screen you might see what you am seeing right now or of course the login from the app might be slightly different so just simply um, or you might be seeing this other screen right over here where you're seeing a user but of course it's requiring a password or something like that um, if you're on this screen as seen immediately now you can simply tap login with another account even if it's the correct account and of course it will give you the feel for your username which is your default username i'll delete what's here as you can see here again it will ask for several things here for your phone number username or email address either will work and of course these are the ones that are associated with your account but the key thing i want to go for right here and right now is this option right here that says forgotten password so simply go ahead and tap the forgotten password and then right away you'll be brought to this screen right here and it's asking you for a number of things it says troubleshoot with login in which is what we're going to help you with enter username or email address and we'll send you a link to get back into your account now of course in this case the key thing is that you have an email address a valid email address now if you use a throwaway email address then you might have a much more difficult time but of course if you have a dedicated email which you have used which you still have access to you should be good so of course if it was a phone number that you use please enter your phone number and of course if it was a username go ahead and enter your username for example here on um, instagram i am do not type what i'm typing in you'll have to enter your unique username all right so in my case that's mine and of course i've entered that next i'm gonna hit next notice right here it searches and once it searches it does give me a account make sure that this is your account in terms of the last picture that was shown again you might find that it brings up a wrong account it would mean that you did not enter the correct username or phone number your phone number is associated or your username is associated with a special account and of course it gives me two options based on the account now it can send me a sms that's to my phone because i have a number associated or it can send me a email now of course i'm going to set ask them to send me a link through my email so i'm just going to go ahead and hit send link and it will send it to my email so i'm going to hit send and it says email sent and it obscures a section of the email for security purposes i'm going to go ahead and hit ok all right now of course it might take a little while for the email to arrive but of course do not worry it should turn up all right so as you saw just then the email came in i'm gonna tap and there you go now notice from here it gives me the options as hierarchy tlc which is my username sorry to hear you have having trouble logging into your instagram we can help you get straight back into your account and of course it's asking me here and this might be different for you it might say either a login as and that's because i already have the credentials set up with facebook and of course this will be available if i have facebook associated already in your case you'll see the option to reset the password you'll tap and it will bring you to a screen it'll ask you to confirm your new password and of course you go back to the application or um, web browser and then log back in all right so in this case if i hit login as my username it will log me straight in since this is a trusted device but of course you see the option here and it's self-explanatory and you should be able to get in now of course for those who are having trouble with seeing that particular screen just now um 
I'm going to show you an alternative way. Or of course, if you wanted me to show you that this actually works, I could hit log in right now and it will log me right in, but I don't need to show you that since I know it will work. All right, so I'll just show you anyway. Let me just show you that it works. So I'm going to say log in. All right, so as you can see there, I've logged in. And the reason why I've logged in, as I said, is because of my associated Facebook account. I already have Facebook logged in on this device. So it uses that to prove because I'll link both accounts and log me in easy as pie. Now, of course, I'm going to show you an alternative way. And I want you to go ahead for uh, my other iPhone users. Go ahead and launch Safari. And this is if you're not seeing anything like on my screen. And you're going to go to Google. And you're going to search from here. And what you're going to search for here is... You're going to search for Instagram and then of course you're going to search for .com. You're going to search. Alright, so you're going to search Instagram.com. Um, now of course the Instagram.com will bring up the Instagram itself. Should be the first link. Just check the uh, web address. It should say HTTPS Instagram.com and of course you're going to go ahead and launch. And of course, it will bring you to this screen right here. And of course, notice that it only brought you back to the application and it gives you the same options. So that is just in case you're not seeing what you were supposed to see. All right, so that should bring you to the screen in question where you should see the forgotten password. So that's another way to get to the screen without going directly through the application. Although in the background, what's happening here, it's simply bringing up the um, Instagram app itself. Um, Additional tip guys, just in case um, to avoid this in the future, after resetting your password as I showed before when you're in your email, um, to get the option where you simply log in and your device simply knows that it's you without needing to um, enter a password or reset or enter the, um, the new password or is simply to follow along as shown here. You can have your device um, remember your password, so for example. On iPhones it will remember your password for you automatically or a good idea would be um, in case just go ahead and um, I'm gonna log in now notice when I hit log in it simply doesn't ask for the password and it will log me in um, two things you can do is number one go ahead after gaining access simply tap um, right here three dots upper right then of course go to um, settings from here go to um, account and account first from here go to linked accounts and of course what I advise here is you go ahead and associate your Facebook now of course most people have Facebook on their device so what will happen is that as long as you have um, linked with um, Facebook you can use your Facebook to log back in so what you got to do here is just click log into your Facebook from here and then it will be associated it will probably if you have multiple um, Facebook pages to choose one and it will link your um, Facebook page and you should be good from here by linking your Facebook with um, sorry your Instagram with Facebook so in the future you can use your Facebook credentials to log in another thing is after resetting the password or of course proving that this device or this account belongs to you you can have your iPhone as well remember the password so if your device offers to remember or memorize the password it's always a good idea especially in your iphone it's very secure so just go ahead and allow it so in the future your device once you're logged into your icloud account it will allow you to simply log in so all right guys that about um sums it up so once you basically do as shown here you should be able to log back into your account on your iphone all right guys just remember that if you choose use the throwaway um email um, you're out of luck as you should always use something like a number or something associated that should work flawlessly without using the incorrect um, information. Um, your phone number as well, if it was an old phone that you use and is no longer associated, it's always a good idea to associate multiple methods such as your phone number and of course link your email or even a backup um, number or something like that. All right guys, I won't um, brag on or ramble on anymore. This is Ricardo Garner from Blog Tech Tips. Saying bye until next time, guys. Bye.